Hey everybody, Ryan Close here from Close Wood Builds and Close Creative. Today I want to talk to you about how I make rounded corners on my charcuterie and cutting boards. Uh, it's a super simple method. I use it on all my boards and all it takes is a Gatorade cap. So um, hope you find it useful. I'll walk you through it. Let's get it started. To use a cap as a jig, you'll need some blue painter's tape, CA glue, and CA glue accelerator if you have it, and of course, a cap. You can use whatever cap you want, but I find that Gatorade caps have the exact radius that I like for my boards. First thing we need to do is stick the cap to the board, and to do that, you'll use blue painter's tape. The point here is to not damage the board with CA glue, so put down a strip or two of painter's tape on the board, and then tape the bottom of your cap. Add CA glue to the tape that's on the board. Spray accelerator on the cap, then press it down onto the board, making sure to feel for the edges of the cap matching the edges of the board. If you don't have accelerator, just hold the cap in place for at least 30 to 45 seconds till it sets. Give the cap a gentle tug to make sure it's secured. Now set up your router table with a flush trim bit with bearing big enough for the depth of your board. Once you're set up, turn on the router and slowly feed the board into the bit. Take off just a little bit at a time to keep from burning or splintering the wood. And make sure you're going against the direction of spin, as usual. Once you've taken as many passes as you need, remove the tape from the board and cap. Then, repeat the steps of gluing the cap on to the remaining three corners. That's it. Now you'll just have a little sanding to do to fully smooth out the radius corners at the end. Thanks for watching today. I hope you found this video helpful and that you'll be able to make some nice rounded corners on your own cutting boards and charcuterie boards using a plastic cap. Stay safe on that router and we'll see you next time. This is Ryan Close for Close Wood Builds. You can find me on Instagram at Close Wood Builds.